Hi everybody, welcome back. It's Nani, how you doing today? I'm doing really good. Happy Friday. I'm back with my Friday favorites and my Christmas gift basket series. I think this may be my last one, unless I think of some other ideas, which I'm sure I will. But this one, I actually have four. I have four different ideas in here, but two are very similar. So I'm just gonna throw it in along with it. What you saw in my thumbnail, I'm gonna call this one like pamper yourself gift basket. And it's gonna be for that lady that doesn't take a lot of time on herself. She's always concerned about everybody else but her. She needs to have a me day. I call them me days. That's when I really don't do anything. I, I give myself a facial, a, a mask, a deep hair treatment. I do my nails. I take a long detox bath. I just spend some time focusing on me. I think every lady out there needs to do that, and men as well, but this, this is for the ladies. Take some time on yourself, you know, just recharge and realize that you're important too. And we all know ladies out there like that, and I'm sure they would very much appreciate. This is very big. This is, I'm sure, well over my $10 limit, but sometimes ladies just, they need that. I'm gonna try to balance this on my shoulder while I pull some things out to show you. I threw in a poof. This is one that's on the bamboo handle, body scrubber, whatever you wanna call this thing. This is for them when they take their bath. The thing is, you can color coordinate this basket. I see a lot of pinks. This is like a mint green on a bamboo handle. I put in some of the body, what is this called? This is the Bolero body yogurt. I put in a thing of that for after they take their bath. I put in some of this I just found recently. This is the hard candy coconut love. And this is the mud to foam face and body cleanser. I put in some of that. I threw in some of these makeup removing wipes that are new out. And this is a two pack. You probably can't tell in there, but there are two. These come in all different colors. I believe they come in square as well. All different colors and patterns. That's what I mean. You could color coordinate a gift basket. I threw in one of the, their little perfumes in pink because I saw a lot of pink here. And this is the luxury, and this is the number 19. I can't even remember what this one was supposed to smell like, but I believe beautiful. And just throw that in there. I didn't have the box to put the box in, but you could. I put some Lift and Firm Eye Cream for while they're pampering themselves. I put in some, um, some face masks. This is by Freeman, name brand, Purifying Grapefruit, two-pack sheet masks. I put in a pack of those. I put in the little pedicure kit. While you're giving yourself a nice hot soaking bath, you could give yourself a little pedicure. I threw in some of these face masks, the, the eye, under eye masks. I love these guys. I absolutely love these. These are going to me once I show this basket. I think these are amazing and they work so well and it's time that I redo it because getting over this cold, man, it, it took a toll. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a me day here real soon. I love these. I threw in a pack of slippers for, for after you have your me day. Little pair of fuzzy slippers. They also have on the kind that you, they have the harder sole bottom and you just kind of slip your the front of your foot in the slippers like grandmas used to wear. They also have those, but I picked these up. I put in some files. These are the diamond, and I believe these are the buffing files. I believe that's what these are. Yes, this is the buffing set. I threw in those in there. I threw in some razors. Everybody, every lady needs razors. These are probably my second favorite razor. They're the Bic and they're the Silky Touch and it's a two pack. I, I like these a lot too, not just the, um, what is it? You know what I'm talking about. The shave cream, Brillo, no. Oh yeah, yeah, never mind. These are probably my second favorite razor. I threw in some of this because this is my favorite lip balm lip therapy at the Dollar Tree. It's like the Dollar Tree version of Carbex. I love this stuff. I have it everywhere. I 
talked about it before. I have one right beside my bed. I have one in my purse. I have one in my travel bag everywhere because this stuff works amazingly well. I put it on every single night before I go to bed and I never have a problem with chapped lips or cold sores or things like that. This cert works so well and just watch for it to be in a two pack, which it mostly is, but every once in a while they try to sneak a one pack in there. Watch for the two pack if you pick this up, it works great. I put in one of the little, oops, something fell, put in one of the little mirrors that's out right now. And this mirror, it sits on your table or makeup, makeup area and it, you know, it has this attached stand and it also has the magnified side which I absolutely love. I put in a pack of their face wipes. These are the Dead Sea, um, the wet cleansing towelettes. I love these things. I've, I have a pack open right now. It's a little bit different than this, but I absolutely love them. So I had a pack of that, put that in there. These are my favorite makeup removing wipes and they are back in stores. You need to watch for them. These work amazingly well. I love them. So I put one of those in there. I put in a thing of the bath bombs. These were out a while back. I'm not sure if this particular style is still in the store, the scent, but I had this on hand, so I just threw it in. So just a bunch of things for pampering yourself, taking a nice long bath, giving yourself a pedicure and a manicure, and just spending some time on yourself. So that was this one. And I am going to have to set this on the floor because it is just entirely too big for this table. So that gives you an idea of something to give to the woman in your life that just needs to take some time for herself. So I'm gonna set this down on the floor, guys. Excuse me for a minute. And on that same kind of line, I made a little smaller version and this I would say would it could be for the, the grown-up ladies as well but I was thinking more on the teenager you know young 20s you know your niece or whatever all cute funky stuff I put in one of the Ioni the lip gloss I put in a a thing of their um highlighter from wet and wild highlighter I put in some their fake eyelashes. These are the Ioni fake eyelashes, and they also have the Kiss eyelash glue. This is eyelash glue, correct? This is yes, it's the eyelash glue. The Ioni, the um, most of the false eyelashes at the Dollar Tree do not come with an adhesive. So if you are going to give it as a gift to someone, pick up pick up an eyelash glue as well and they do usually have different brands but this is a name brand this is kiss i picked up some eyeshadow pick up an eyeshadow palette for them so you have all this different makeups i picked up the eye trim or the eyelash curler this is trim brand they're out in the stores right now this is one of the April bath and shower, their spa line. This is the under eye and lip masks. I have not tried this yet, but I'm going to. I'm curious to see how this one works compared to the other ones that I showed in the other gift basket. But I thought that was so cute with the lips. A teenage girl would absolutely love that. Put another one of the mirrors in here. And I put in this art of masking kit. And I did see these in my stores well, when I went shopping before I got sick, they were still there. <coughs> and this comes with, I'm sorry, guys. This comes with one, two, three, four, five, six masks made by Spa Life. Excellent deal. It also has the um, applicator, whatever you want to call that, the applicator on it. I thought that was just so cute. And I also put in a little makeup bag. They have all different sizes, colors, designs, anything you could possibly want in a makeup bag. Get your makeup bags at the Dollar Tree because they have awesome ones. But you could throw anything in here for the teenage teenage girl. Just, you know, they have eyeliners and mascaras and every type of makeup and brand of makeup imaginable. So this is more for, I was thinking more for a teenager. You know, the niece that you have that you're just not quite sure what to get. 
they would absolutely love something like this, something to play with. Maybe throw in a pack of the artificial nails and the glue to, to put them on. Just very cute. You could put it in any type of basket, even a stocking. They have really cute stockings coming out. Put everything into a stocking and use a stocking as the gift basket. Just cute. I'm going to put this down as well. My table is full, guys. This one is going to be for the hot chocolate, cozy, cold winter day type gift basket. I put in a thing of the marshmallow cream. I, I noticed a lot of you have never tried marshmallow cream in your hot chocolate. You have to try that. But they have it out right now, and it's usually right beside the boxes of the hot chocolate mix. So I put that in there. I put in some of their beautiful mugs. I love these coffee mugs. It's going to be really hard for me to show you that. I believe they're called like Irish cream coffee mugs. They're just beautiful. So I put in two of those. I put in a box of the Hershey's hot chocolate mix. I haven't seen this in the last week or so in the stores. Swiss Miss is out in full force though, plain or with marshmallows. So let me see if I can get this out of here. But this was the Hershey's that was out probably three weeks ago. And how many packs? It has six packs in here. And they also had the York Peppermint Patty, which is delicious. I've tried it. So, so good. And then I put in some of the, the ones that I could find. I guess there's a few more. All of these scrumptious cookies. These are the puff pastries in strawberry. These are the puff pastries in apple cinnamon. And one of you ladies had suggested microwaving them for a few seconds before you eat them. So I'm going to try that really, really soon. These are the scrumptious cookies in the chocolate brownie with hazelnuts. And these are the scrumptious in, what does it say? Peanut butter and chocolate. Oh, those look so good. So just a little hot chocolate basket idea. I just, I would love a gift like that. I just, I love this kind of stuff. I love homemade gifts. So that's for the hot chocolate cozy winter day that you want to give someone. And last but not least, I have for the art lover in your life. They have so many art supplies at the Dollar Tree in awesome quality as well. When they came out with these black ones, I couldn't even believe it. That just blew my mind. I have a couple of these still left on hand, but black canvases, and these are on the um, like the wooden frame. But you can throw some canvases in there and they have every size. I had to put some the smaller ones in this basket because I, I didn't have a bigger basket. I have the big, I think they're 11 by 14 from the Dollar Tree, but I didn't want to shove them in here. And I believe this is an eight by 10. I don't want to have the ring light flash you. They have the little packs and these are the five by sevens and it is a two pack of those canvases. They have these little, um, by Crafter Square, they're art palettes and you get six in here. They're little trays for you to put your different colors of paint in and then they, they're washable. You can wash them out and use them again. So I thought that was awesome. They have all different types of paint brushes. These are the foam brushes and these were in Crafter Square and if you look in the tool section, where all the tools and paint brushes and duct tape and that type of thing. They have a bigger pack. I think it's a pack of eight in various sizes in that area of the store. But, and I, I believe it's um, Tool Bench is the name of the, the company or whatever that makes it. But they were all out, so I picked up these instead. And this is a six pack and they're one inch of the foam brushes. All different types of different types of paint brushes. These were by Jot, and this is a six pack, and I hope you can, can you see it on there, the different tips of paintbrush of these. And then this one is by Crafter Square, and it is also a six pack. Let me turn it around this way so you can see. That's really hard to show. I'm sorry, guys, that, that plastic just does not make it easy to show the end of the brushes, the tips. And then they have every kind of paint 
you can possibly imagine. These are the tubes of Crafter Square, the Tempera watercolors, and it's you get five different colors in here. But they, I actually like the ones in the squeeze tube that kind of looks like a toothpaste tube. Those are my favorite paints from the Dollar Tree. I buy those all the time. I absolutely love them. But Hubby actually bought these water watercolor ones. And another thing, if you would decide to do an art kit like this, right now, and I have been hunting and I cannot find them, they have um, an, an art easel. It's a wooden art easel. From what I have seen, it's probably about 10 inches high. I have not been able to find it, but I am on the lookout for it because I think that would be amazing to throw in a basket like this. Just so many different things that you can do at the Dollar Tree on the cheap, but it's awesome products and they work well. Just amazing gifts you can do. And don't forget, in any of the gift baskets, you could put a little envelope in there with some cash, a cute little card, a gift card for you know whatever it may be that you know that person really likes. Little gift card for five dollars or ten dollars or you know whatever you can afford. And if it's just the gift basket itself, it is an amazing gift all on its own. So I hope these little ideas have helped you out. I hope you enjoyed them. If I do come up with more ideas, which I more than likely will. I will just throw out some more videos for you. So anyway guys, enjoy. I'm going to get off of here and I'm going to get all this stuff put away and taken downstairs into my Mrs. Claus's room and I'm going to have to go through everything now and figure out what goes where, but that's okay. You guys have a great rest of your day. If you enjoy these type of videos, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best and I, I truly, truly mean that. Have a great day, everyone, and I'll talk to you again here really soon. Peace.